Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I tried to avoid this video, but the more I fucking read, the, the more pissed off I got. So basically, Tesla, uh, Tesla's CEO worries about aggressively raising interest rates has helped create an untenable situation for car financing. Well, you know what, man? Make your fucking cars cheaper. We have a $100 deposit down on an Aptera that is designed from the ground up to be an electric car, okay? It makes yours look like a fucking refrigerator driving down the road. I get free gas. I never have to plug it in. Where I live, I will never have to plug my car in. The amount of mileage we use and the amount of sunlight we get are, are all rainy, uh, you know, overcast days. Maybe every now, great now and again, might have to plug it in and I can plug it into my fucking 110. So, you know, it's not our fault that you're building the car the way you are. Corporations in America have raped the American public so hard since the pandemic started. They just went batshit fucking crazy for profit. Okay, and that is the inflation we're having. It has nothing to do with monetary theory, okay? This is plain outright fucking greed by industry. The gas company, they haven't built a new gasoline refinery since 1964 and they're gonna bitch because there's no gas supply. Fuck you, okay? Quit selling $170,000 cars. I don't care about self-driving. I could give a fuck about self-driving. If you think that I'm gonna let my family and my loved ones be at the mercy of some goddamn software program right now, you are wrong, okay? Wrong. It's not time for that until everyone has it, okay? When everyone has it, my faith will go up. It'll skyrocket. But until the other fucking moron that's gonna run into you, the side of your car has it, all right? It's not doing anyone any good and you wanna charge people an outrageous amount for a fucking service. It's now a service. So, just make just make a, a better designed car, man. The the it's it started out at twenty eight. It's probably going to end up running us around three thousand around around thirty thousand dollars for a four hundred and fifty mile car range car that is made that'll never rust. Um, you know, it's just a superior energy efficient car in every way over a Tesla and it just beat a Tesla 3. So, much bigger cabin than the Tesla 3 for two people. Gigantic hatchback, eight feet long. So, I'm sorry, but just build a cheaper car. If you, you know, if you want to stop interest rates from going up, then you're gonna to have to convince the uh, American businesses to quit ripping the American public off with the outrageous fucking price hikes for no reason other than they can do it. Oh, the candy bar used to be this big, now it's this big and another dime more. Why? Did it get better? Did the ingredients change? Oh, well, you know, uh, 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 transportation, the, the, all the same old fucking bullshit that the, they always tell us. Okay? The numbers don't lie. Corporate profits have skyrocketed over the last 30 years. It's just been ridiculous. But the last two has just been evil. That's what it's been, evil. So, Elon, again, you're wrong. I'm sorry, okay? I think you should just, just go back, relax, take a toke, quit thinking about being the Twitter man and maybe even just write the whole fucking thing off as a lesson you learned in life, okay? So that it doesn't drown you like, you know, a drowning man is going to push you underwater, man, and that's what's happening right now. I don't want to see that happen to anyone, okay? Because you should be using your influence for good and you're not. You're starting to turn into this evil guy, and, you know, there was the one of the few redeeming qualities that I saw in you was that you brought electric cars to the American market. Now, I will always be grateful for that. But now I'm starting to think that that's like, you know, I'm going to have to say that that doesn't make up for it. And not at all, because someone was going to do it sooner or later. You just happen to be the guy willing to come in with the big balls and sink your money into it. That's what that's what I'm starting to feel.